This is the video review for Transformers Hunt for the Cons Voyager Class Sea Spray. Sea Spray is a nice little hovercraft. Um, he's got these cool little harpoon missile launchers, but be careful of the missiles because one, I mean, they shoot very well, but one little flick of motion can trigger them really well, but that one didn't want to fire. Like, see, you can tab it. And you can um fire it out and it'll shoot cameras and put those up to the side. Take that off. Yeah, very nice. Um it says C S P Ray on the side. Same thing right here. C S P Ray. It's got the Autobot symbol and C S P Ray again on top. Um he does have this cool ramp that you can flip up and down and back and forth, but that's due to the transformation. And then back here to his propellers, they have, have a bit of articulation. They can rotate 360 degrees. They can do that. Let's do the transformation. And it, what's really interesting is inside here, he's had he has these little rudders. And on other video reviews, it says that they say that they can't spin. But it's, but there's a little knob back there that if you turn. They actually kind of rotate, it's kind of hard to see. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Nice, clear, translucent light. So yeah, that's all for him in vehicle mode. Now to transform him, it's very simple. He's a level three, kind of the transformation with the lux. But it's very simple. You just want to come around here, and you want to kind of rotate these legs upward. Do the same with this one. You want to split the legs. You want to rotate his crotch up and then rotate these legs down and then just straighten up the legs. Now you can fold these back but lift these up. I like to fold them back. They kind of give him some heels first to support him when standing and they would basically have the top part of him. Now what we're going to want to do now is we're going to want to fold this back and we're going to want to Split the head, the top part, and then you want to bring these bits down. And there's a little tab right there and a little hole in his arm that you want to just bring in until you hear the snapping sound. That wasn't it. And then you have these little bolt pieces where the missiles were. You want to fold those in, up like that. Around the head. And then come around right into the backpack, fold the ramp down, fold this in, and kind of rotate these and bend them forward, and then kind of bend them back. And then there's a hole right here, and there's a tab on his back. You want, and then there's a dope, there's another tab right here, and a hole right there. You want to make sure that this lines up like that. And then you want to make sure you have it lined up so that this, you want to push this all the way down so that this tab and this hole lines up. And that snaps together. And there we have Transformers Hunt for Decepticons Voyager Class Sea Spray in his robot mode. I mean, he's a very, very nice figure. I'm really digging the whole look to him. He's got that um, aquatic looking head with the little holes and the um, kind of scuba tank looks. I'm his <laughs> And he's got his little air tank um, backpack so he can swim. And uh, one cool feature is that if you fold these up and get your nail in here, he actually does have flippers. Now to get those out, you just want to fold up that and fold this out. And there he's got his flippers. So very nice. And then his weapons you can put in either his hand or store them back under him from when he was in boat mode. You can get him some cool poses. He's about to shoot some Decepticons. So yeah, very nice figure. I really hope you pick him up. You won't be disappointed with this figure. Um, one drawback about this figure is that his 
waist right here doesn't really tab in, it just clicks in. And his backpack doesn't want to stay in either. Oh so, yeah, that's pretty much it. So there you have it, Transformers, Huff of the Septicons, Voyager Class, Sea Spray. Talk to you later.